נאפשר הערה אחת או שניים, עוד נקבל סיכומים. לא יהיה יעיל בפורום כל כך גדול לקיים דיון, ולכן אנחנו נקיים אותו בקבוצות. בצורה כזאת גם נוכל לתדרך בדברים מעשיים שאנחנו מבקשים מנציגי היישובים. in Samaria, Judea and Samaria. And uh, we are here to uh, decide what action to take in reference to the uh, court ruling, in reference to the, what the government plans to do uh, about uh, Alon Moré and uh, the situation there. Are you aware that uh, some of your decision might be bringing to the fall of Dr. Are you aware that uh, some of your decision might be bringing the fall of this government? It's possible. Uh, we are not interested in bringing about the fall of this government. Uh, actually, uh, the problem that exists is between, is between the High Court and the government. The High Court did not say that Alon Moré must be taken down. That wasn't the uh, issue. The High Court said that the manner in which the government brought the case to them, that it was for purposes of security, uh, that was the issue. Uh, if the government falls as a result, uh, it's not our purpose. It's, uh, that's their problem, not ours. Uh, we ourselves do not want to bring the fall of the government. We still hope that this government will uh, keep to its promise uh, the uh, majority of the country elected this government uh, on, uh, on a platform of uh, uh, populating Judea, Samaria, uh, the Golan, Gaza, uh, all of these areas with uh, Jews uh, and uh, to increase the population here and to keep it Jewish. <laughs> Mr. Atzmi, what were the resolutions of the meeting and how do you see the consequences of it? The meeting was not a meeting of an executive committee but of representatives of all the settlements in Judea and Samaria. There were also representatives from Hevel Yamid, from the area of Northern Sinai. Uh, this was uh, the, the uh, purpose of the meeting was first of all to give the representatives of our public information as to the present situation uh, regarding the judgment of the High Court uh, in the matter of Elot Moray, situation of the uh, positions of the various 
ministers and the parties and the government. And uh, after information was given, uh, very general outlines were given because uh, this is uh, this was a large public, and of course, uh, no uh, no detailed planning uh, could be divulged. Um, the general uh, idea given to the representatives was as follows: We have no clash and no argument whatsoever with the, Israel, with, with the High Court of Israel. Uh, it was uh, pointed out and the, the pertinent passages were read from the judgment, were read to the representatives, uh, where the High Court says, we have not been asked whether the Jewish people has a right to Judea and Samaria. We have been asked by the Israeli government whether on the assumption that Judea and Samaria is occupied territory, on the assumption it is allowed to take private property. On this assumption, the whole judgment was written. The High Court pointed out that the Israeli government claims that the um, war conventions, Hague Convention and Geneva Convention, do not apply to Judea and Samaria. And only the humanitarian rules of those conventions do explain to the public that our main demand from the Israeli government, first and foremost, is that the Israeli government changes the basis, the, the basis of presentation of her rights in Judea and Samaria be it by law, be it by, uh, by uh, uh, promulgation of any kind, by the uh, Attorney General or by the government, that we are not conquerors on foreign soil in Judea and Samaria. And if the... the me, uh, one minute. The immediate result in court would be that the whole matter is not justiciable in court. So this is our main and foremost demand. Because if this demand is not met immediately, uh, the, uh, stand, the pending cases regarding Salfit, which is the town of Ariel, are going to be lost. The government is going to lose the second high court case regarding the town of Ariel. This is a matter of more than 3,000 dunams where, it, where on this present basis of occupation, uh, we have a second Elon Moray in a few weeks. And then the government is going to lose the third high, high court case in the town of Efrat in Judea, near the Etzion block. And this will be the third Elon Moray. And then will come an Elon Moray in Kiryat Arba. More, moreover, all Israeli settlements are now only temporary. Therefore, we, our first and foremost demand is a, a government decision that we are not conquerors on foreign soil in Judea and Samaria, which immediately and automatically changes any pending decision of the High Court. But, Second demand. But if the government will not come to your way of seeing it, if the government was will not go I by your demand, this. what would I you do? I shall come to this. I, if, if, if there is a committee which has worked out a various... Uh, your demands. So two things uh, have been decided upon on an operative basis. One, that we mobilize all the settlements between behind the Green Line, on the, on the eastern side of the Green Line in Judea and Samaria, uh, to be ready not to leave the settlers of Elon More alone should such a black day come. Secondly, uh, the settlers of Judea and Samaria will give a hand in mobilizing various um, various uh, towns and, and settlements in what is called the State of Israel so that we, the settlers,